Kristen Scalia and I'm from Cannibal Home in downtown Jersey City right at Montgomery Street and Grove Street. Uh, Cannibal Home is a lifestyle store dedicated to budget-friendly, interesting curiosities. So we sell everything from apparel to home goods to vintage to found objects. Since our inception back about five years ago, we've always been dedicated to the arts. So it's very important for us to be able to give back to the community that supports us and keeps us in business. And one of the first initiatives I started here was to do craft classes as well as chamber music events in the shop. All of our chamber music is always free. All of our artists are local. We take donations to help support them. And it's really important for me to be able to help um, preserve sometimes a dying art um, and also brings different kind of crafts to a very friendly environment. Some people think of classical music as something that's only performed in you know a big studio or a stadium. Here we're able to bring it to a retail shop somewhere unexpected and to be able to introduce it to people who love music as well as people who are maybe getting into it. Hello, I'm Maz Swift. I'm a violinist and singer and performer with a chamber music organization here in Jersey City called Convivo. I am a classically trained violinist and um, self-taught singer. I sang in the choir with my parents growing up, um, but I have always had a love for chamber music and in particular um, playing music for people of all kinds. And so I, I really love the Convivo thing in particular, and I also love working here with Kristen at Cannibal Home because it's a different environment to hear some of this great music that has previously been, you know, sort of locked away in concert halls. Um, I'm really passionate about music being available to every time type of person that could conceivably even possibly want to maybe find out about. Um, I think it's a sort of healing kind of thing and it's just a joy to be able to bring that to people.
quite a while ago because we both love fiddle tunes of all different styles and I was struck that we have a similar style of playing which is um, I think expressive and also like rhythmic and influenced by the various fiddle styles so we've kept in touch and I was excited to have a chance to come out and collaborate with her and it was a really great chance to write some stuff for the two of us and try out different material and see what things really work well. Just to see where the story ends. 